Download this code and get free GPT-40 from CodeGive.com, link in the description below. Certainly. In Java, you can replace traditional if-else statements with lambda expressions in certain scenarios, particularly when you're working with functional interfaces. A functional interface is an interface that has exactly one abstract method. The most common example is the predicate T interface. Hashtag 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 overview of lambdas in Java. Lambdas were introduced in Java 8 and allow you to write instances of single method interfaces, functional interfaces, in a more concise way. This is particularly useful for writing cleaner and more readable code. Hashtag 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 when to use lambdas. Lambdas can be particularly useful when you have simple conditional logic that can be expressed within a single method. Here is a common scenario where you can replace if else with a lambda expression. Hashtag 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 example scenario. Let's say you want to evaluate a number and return a string based on that number. If the number is positive, return positive. If the number is negative, return negative. If the number is zero, return zero. Hashtag 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 traditional if else implementation. Here's how you might implement this with a traditional if else statement. Hashtag 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 using lambdas. To replace the if else statement with lambdas, you can use a map to associate conditions with their corresponding results. Here's how to do it. 1. Create a functional interface that takes an integer and returns a string. 2. Use lambdas to define the behavior for each case. 3. Store these lambdas in a map to easily retrieve the corresponding action based on the number. Hashtag 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 lambda implementation. Hashtag 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 explanation. 1. Functional interface, we use function integer, string as our functional interface, where our lambda expressions will map an integer to a string. 2. Map of evaluators, we create a map that holds the conditions as keys and the corresponding lambda expressions as values. 3. Stream processing, we use Java streams to filter the map based on the input number and apply the appropriate lambda. 4. Default case, if none of the conditions match, we return unknown. Hashtag 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 conclusion. Using lambdas can make your code cleaner and more expressive, especially when you have simple conditional logic. In complex scenarios, however, traditional control structures may still be more readable. Always choose the approach that enhances clarity for your specific use case.